What the heck? Look at this. It's a mid-century teak nut platter. It's a little Christmas tree. It's like everything you need. You have your Christmas tree, you can put nuts on there. Well, I would hope for that price, it would be everything you need. <laughs> it would be the only thing we would get here today, baby. Hi, I'm Duke. And I'm Lola. And this is Bossa Nova Life. And today we are in Vancouver, Washington at... The Old Glory Antique Mall. start on the outside in Vancouver, Washington. Ooh, I like these tiny little booths. They're so fun. They do have very tiny little booths. Yeah, they're just cute. And there's usually something fun hidden away. So, I'm gonna see what I can find. I like those. Look at this fancy. This set is very tempting though. I didn't really, it's, so you got all three glasses. Oh, because I got some guy next door here. I, and I, the pitcher. You know, I, I, I can negotiate on the price a little bit too. Oh no, that's it's wonderful. Crazy. I was just looking at it. It's got a full picture. You got the glasses. I am almost 100% positive that Lola is going to want this right here for our new 1966 trailer we're working on that's going to have pink accents. I'm going to get that and see what she thinks. And the price is $2, so you can't go wrong on that. Wait, Lola does it for So I, yes, I saw this before Duke, but that's okay. He likes it too. And then these cute little pot holders, aren't those adorable? Mm -hmm. I mean, I wouldn't touch anything super hot with them, but they're very cute. Six double make you holler. Yeah, that's awesome. So these are coming home with us. <laughs> Hey, Kitsch Kitten. Hey. What's like going on? Shirt. Look at that. Yeah. I love the new shirt. This is what I wear when I go antiquing. That's because you've always been the Kitsch Kitten. I know. We don't usually talk about this on the camera too much, but that is her nickname yes. when we're out shopping for the antique. So you went and got this awesome shirt made up. Yes, and there's more for you to purchase. They can purchase them online? What? Yes. That's crazy. 100% anywhere Lola is going to be. This is pretty. You're imagining that. Yeah. On a coffee table. Yes, obviously. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. This town here is pretty cute. This doesn't even hurt. I know. Wait till you start falling. It's treasure craft. <laughs> is it treasure craft? It looks like treasure craft. It is treasure craft. Nice. It's pretty. And $9? $32. $32. A very different price. <laughs> I was say $9. That's amazing. We're buying it right now. $32 is fair. This ashtray is phenomenal. Yeah. Look at this. You have some nature. That's you can hear, hear the birdies swooping. Mm -hmm. It's amazing when you get the, like the 60s, 70s lamps. Yeah. Basically it's a backlit plastic that moves behind it that creates that motion. That's mm -hmm. why they're hard to find because a lot of them broke. Yeah. But they, I mean, you know, you have a waterfall. Hey, last night we were out at a bar and they had an original one from the land of sky blue waters. They did. I wanted to point this out. My parents always had an armadillo basket when I was growing up. They're kind of creepy. They're, cre they're, they're creepy. Not creepy anymore. They're creepy. <laughs> Is this your booth? This is my booth. Man, yes. we must be on just my the perfect day. I don't normally catch all these people working in their own booths. This is great. My mother will be 100 years old, March 7th, and this was hers when she was a girl. Oh, goodness. <laughs> that that right there? This. Uh, she was 117 pounds, 5 oh, foot yeah, 7 and a little. half. Okay, you don't Thank think you. it would no. fit me, right? They don't make them that size anymore. <laughs> That's what goes on. I tell people like that's like I'm looking for like vintage shirts, so they don't make them in my size hardly. I found Hawaiiana shirts, but they don't look like vintage vintage. They look like well, you never know. Yeah. If you want to get your yacht rock on, they will hook you up. That's pretty cool. Look at that. That's legit. 
$24. That's a good price, too. That's right, man. Oh, look at this. <laughs> well, we're from Eugene, so those are the enemy. <laughs> my my son-in-law has um, vanity plates. They say oh, nice. duck fan. Don't I get said, us wrong; those are our lovely cousins, and we we adore them. Well, <laughs> yeah, I'm enthralled. Talk about kitsch. So these aren't things that I would put in my house necessarily, but I, I that, like that. That screams Lola. I like this. I like this funky thing. I okay, this, plants in them. this is like this is when the 70s hippie Lola comes out. Uh, there's, I was a hippie child. Was you a, were a hippie child. It's okay. <laughs> uh, I mean, those are a little gaudy, but still, I don't mind them. I think this is amazing. So, you know, it's quite a bit of kitchen here. What about Dragon Ball? It, you know what? It is Chinese New Year. Hey, Lola. Hi. We haven't even gone through 25% of this place yet. I know. And it continues onwards step and up. upwards. Step it up, babe. Well, not physically. Well, I mean, it does say step up, so we do have to go upwards. So I was correct. Well, let's find something. Mm. What are we looking at, babe? I found the dishes to a lazy Susan, and they're pink, and they're strawberry. Oh, goodness. Yeah, look at that. They are pink. Can you ever have too many lazy Susans? Yes. Really, can you? Yes, yes, you can. <laughs> well, yes, it's a dress coat. It's oh, just it's absolutely yeah. love and gorgeous. But, <laughs> but anyway. Uh, oh, no. It's a chicken Lola and it's an chickens. egg dish. And I oh, love egg dish. dishes. Oh, wait. It's, the, it's the combination of yes. both things. Stylized chicken, check. Yes. Big dish, check. Holds eggs. Holds deviled Triple eggs. Triple threat. Oh, my goodness. I mean, if it was just turquoise, it would be like. Almost as cool as this float. Perfect. Which I'm half tempted. If it was 75 instead of 125, I'd snap it up. We actually already have one of these at home on a wall. Sometimes when you're in an antique store, you see something and it's just, it's sad. It's a sad thing. You're like, that's that's just a sad thing to see in an Why, antique store. Why did you see? A Disneyland mug from a poor girl named Kathy. Yeah. A, either does not have her Disneyland mug anymore, which she is sad, it. or B, is no longer around for Maybe the Disneyland she's mug. she's in the big Disneyland These things are not supposed to happen in the world's happiest Disney, place. Yeah, maybe she's in Disneyland forever. Always make me think of dusty houses. The blankets do, that yeah. are like that? The Afghans that so, are like this, mm -hmm. and like this one. I mean, maybe it's a stocking, they're so kind of cool. someone's turned them into stockings. Or just knitted them. My grandparents always had them, and my grandparents were smokers, so these always remind me of just like smoky, true. True. dusty houses. That sounds like all my memories of the 70s and 80s. Yeah, a lot of brown <laughs> covered smoke items. They are cool. That's you're, ask stuff. you're asking me what this is? I don't it is. Well, I'm not an expert and I don't know exactly, but I can tell you A, that it is a decanter of some sort. It had something in it. And it I could have figured that out. For, but I'm going to go with Mexican. Looks like yeah. Aztec or something of some sort. And then we're going to look at the bottom of it and it is porcelain, original design, Los Angeles. There's really not a lot here to say. Uh, I just was wondering. I'm also curious. Five dollars. <laughs> they obviously don't know. More kitschy I stuff. I would have never guessed in a million years that you like that. But I mean, the, they're cute. That's why I give kitschy. you the name Kitsch Kitten. Yeah, because I like some kitsch. Because you always surprise me. Doesn't always go home with us, but I can appreciate. I mean, you even take me home, so yeah. what can I say? Well, I can't complain. <laughs> I cannot complain. Hitting some mid century glory. Oh, oh, oh. Lola found something else. Look at this. But it's not kitschy, so you can't get it. <laughs> this is I will use that against you. Beautiful house coat. No, this totally is delightful. wear this to the pajama rama at Viva. You could wear it for pajama rama. I feel like the waist is a little small for me, but it's so pretty. Mm -hmm. It's not a bad price. How much is not a bad price? $145. 145 baby. Yeah, I like it. I think it's awesome. I mean, if you want to go buy that brand new at say like Macy's, you'd yeah, probably pay that. I would, yeah. And it would be built half as well yes. and not be cool. Never have enough person. 
apparently. If this was, if informed. these were pink roses, I'd be all about it, but I don't have much yellow in my life. That's true. So That's I don't know true. if I would be able to really rock it the right way. I don't know how I feel about using a camera to film cameras. It's kind of inception-y. So, bamboo, oh my gosh, what did you find? Bamboo China set, 92 pieces for a hundred bucks. 92 pieces for a hundred dollars. Look at that, that's gorgeous. That's also a dollar a piece. That yeah. That's phenomenal. It is, uh, do we need China? I mean, to the point where if we hadn't just replaced all of our dishes at home, like around Christmas time, I I'd think, be kind of tempted. I mean, tempted. yeah, <laughs> I would be tempted too. That's amazing. I need a gravy boat. Look at that. That is awesome. Yeah, it's pretty. I like the bamboo. It's a little dusty, but that's okay. Look at that, that's so pretty. Gorge. Do you have a vintage red trailer? This place could hook you up. And 125 is actually not a bad price on these vintage, because their ones are all metal. Those amazing vintage coolers. Am I the only person who feels like this clock is A, cool, but B, almost looks like a vintage iron. Like you're gonna iron your clothes with it when you're done. It's all solid metal, but that is so cool. <laughs> that's not the only American that's gotten hammered. Fish is Leave cute. it to Lola to notice. I totally missed everything up there. I go slower, I find stuff. That's right, that lamp is legit, and so is that bar cart. Yeah, I that like- painting actually behind oh all of it. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. That is, oh wow, that is, yeah. That the real mid-century could not hide up there. Even the stools down on the end are great. They'd be amazing for two people. I like the shadow box. We have one or else I would say we need it. You don't want the shadow box. You know why you don't want the shadow box all over? Why? There's a creeper in it. Oh, well, that's true. Okay, so it's forty dollars. Vintage Hollywood. Lola loves these things, and we do need a garbage can for our 1966 travel leads that's gonna be finished here in the next couple months. That is pretty magnificent. I have a feeling she's gonna she's gonna want that when she gets down here. But as usual, I've gotten ahead of her. I found something that you might want for the trailer. Okay. Ooh, yes. Would this be our little trash can? Well, yeah. Go in the bathroom, maybe. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I like it. There, you know, there's an um, antique store on the coast that has tons of the gold bathroom stuff. So we'd have to make sure that these little legs would come back out and be okay. Uh, but yeah, this would fit perfect in our atomic kitty. I had a feeling. Hmm, okay, we're taking it. Lola likes things that are gold. I also like and this pink. box. Come fly with me. Well, Lola, we yes. came and we saw all the cool things that yes. are in the store. And you're still looking. And I'm still looking. There might be more that I missed. You never know. That's you me when I get those dishes. Those were pretty. So what all have you gotten so far? Got I those. got this little cute trash can, and then I got two pot holders. Mm -hmm. And I think that's it. I think that's what we got today. All right. And my kitchen kitten shirt. That's right. So, uh, yeah, there's some good stuff. There's yeah. some fun stuff in there. And we're going to head out to some more. Yes. You know what the most important thing to learn here today is? What? No tweakers. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I've learned. I'm, I'm good. Tweakers and antiques don't go together. <laughs> no, they don't. Believe me, we had one. She gave us a counterfeit $100 bill. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs>